All right, you guys, welcome back to another episode here in Civilization VI Gathering Storm. And in today's episode, we are continuing off as our playthrough of Georgia. And I'm not really sure what I want to do right now, honestly. Huh. I mean, I think I was thinking about expanding in the last episode, possibly, which would be a good idea. Um, you go there and give me some salt. So that I can actually start trading. Let's see. I can't trade yet. So let's see. Let's see. Settlers. How are we going to expand? Definitely want one here. And I'm thinking one there. Why would this, a little lake, ever flood because of global warming? That doesn't make any sense. But okay. Sure. Whatever. <sighs> Maybe farther down here? Or at least definitely moving down here. So at least one. Possibly two still. Maybe three on this edge. It depends. And then we also need... Where are we right now? We are in the year 250 AD. We're still pretty small. We don't have much going for us. We definitely need to build our holy site up more so that we can get more holy faith per turn going. And we need holy sites constructed in every city so we get extra faith per turn because that'll be extremely useful. And we need to get a trade route going to Candy, which I think we do have. No, Candy is trading with us. That's what's happening. Um, please do a lighthouse so we get another trade route. Trade route two candy and we can have two one to buenos Aires and one to candy that would be very good and very useful well i do not like the look of this he seems to be gearing up for war okay yep you're definitely not gonna make friends with me what if i trade with you would you stop trying to go to war with me because i don't have really the capability to handle that right now I mean, I'm sure I could make it work and just defend myself, and I might be able to levy this military. How much do you cost? Levy military, 490. Yeah, I might be able to in a few turns. Hopefully, he's not actually trying to attack me. Why isn't he going for them? Like, seriously, why won't you go for England? Should I try yelling at him? No, I don't want to antagonize him. Hmm. If he goes to war with me, he goes to war with Candy and Buenos Aires. I don't know if he knows that. Well, I'm sure he knows that. He's just one of those territori territorial expansionist guys. Which is slightly annoying. Oh, I'm surprised I even found that. Hmm. Well, I was definitely not prepared for this to turn into a war. And I really hope it still doesn't, because they got quite a lot of people here. At least I know I stand a fighting chance if it does turn into that. Gosh. Click. Click. You, go there. One new population. Awesome, possum. Let's appoint you... to... Yeah, go there. Ugh, oh, I really don't want to go to war right now. Nope. Really? Yep. Yep, that was quick. And we just made a trade deal, too. Seriously? How rude can he get? How rude can he get? Seriously. I don't want to purchase any of these. Because I want to be able to levy their army. Although their army is not terribly big. I guess I can just switch to making men in a second. And it should be fine. I swear, if he makes peace with me after this, this is going to be ridiculous. Because I'm half thinking about just trying to kill him. <laughs> I'll have to build that. Because it gives me a diplomatic point. <sighs> do it. I need to do that. Oh my gosh, might as well just do this. Fine, what? Oh my goodness. 
you come for this guy. Yeah, you are. Come on now. Game, don't let him take it. Please! Actually, I could just purchase one. That's fine. Come on. Load a little faster so I can actually do something. Let's move this archer here. Just so that I definitely have another person ready to come and attack. You go there. Please kill him. Thank God. Oh, thank God. That felt good. <laughs> Got to keep my traitor. That's good. Oh, thank you, Candy, for taking the full brunt of it. Heck yeah. I will do that. Thank you for your uh, help and actually paying me well. <laughs> he has so many men. He must have levied someone. Who did you levy? Trajan, uh, not someone I know, that's for sure. Well, this was unexpected. Okay, cool. So, I guess I'll be attacking England and completely taking her out. Got it. Oh my gosh, people. Y'all are so aggressive. For no reason. Absolutely no reason. I was so peaceful. Just having my own fun over here. I guess they just want me to take over this entire area. Because I'll gladly do that if that's what they're trying to get. So, they're kind of... They're going to be screwed now. I guess I just somehow became some type of game all about war right now. At least in this episode. Come on now. Get him down. You can get him down. It's just one guy. Ugh. No, please complete that. You're gonna skip a turn. I'm gonna keep one archer there forever so that we can finish building that and get that point because I need it. And I need not to die. That's my thing. I just need not to die. This is just annoying. No, I don't need to do that. They really are just mean. She must be mad about my religion coming. Huh. Oh my gosh, look at all this. Where? I wish I could see farther out. I wish I had satellites already <laughs> in 640 AD. That's what I wish. I wish I had satellites. Uh, okay, you shoot. You shoot. Come on now. You can do it. Um... I suppose you can go there, yeah. There we go. They're just gonna keep getting bombarded. I hope they know that. Just go for it. Get him. Only one left. One little guy left. What you gonna do? What you gonna do, huh, England? You thought we were weak? You were wrong. And with this, I should finally be getting rid of... The last... Oh, she's got a slinger. Wow, she's got one little slinger over here. Really? You can't even kill this guy? Are you kidding me? You're supposed to be able to kill this guy. Oh my gosh, why didn't you kill him? Now you're going to get killed by a slinger. Oh, what is this? My people and gone to the desert. I have no idea what that is. Do, 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 do. Come on, I clicked the next button. Let's go. Let's go. Now you're definitely Eastern Orthodoxy. Maybe that's why you're so angry. Gosh. And the, he, someone, I'm assuming him, took away Buenos Aires. How, how dare he? Oh. This guy, he just lives to make me mad, basically. <laughs> that's exactly what's happening. It's just a bunch of... I was gonna have such a nice and easy, like, simple little playthrough, but no, that did not definitely happen at all in this episode, that is for sure. Oh my goodness, please take that. Please build yourself a granary. You need to keep attacking that barbarian. You can chill and just hold on. You need to go to candy. 
Uh, is this the same one I had? This is the same one I had. You need to go to Buenos Aires. Continue that route. And I can purchase another trade route. Can I purchase a unit? I can. Um, yeah. And purchase a trader. Beautiful. And then let's have you purchase a builder. Very, very nice. And then down here, I'm surprised I did not attack this guy. Uh, yeah, promote him. Take him out. Da, 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 da. Finally, that guy is down. And we can continue going around it. I want you actually to go back there and continually heal. Just so we can finish building this guy. We're so close to it. I just need to get it done. So we're here, and I was really hoping this was like an emergency declaration so I can yell at them, but that didn't happen. <laughs> uh, chosen Luxury grants no amenities. Do this. Chosen Luxury grants amenities. Let's do salt. That would be extremely helpful. Especially since that's all I have. <laughs> Producing or purchasing military. This currency costs 100% of the cost. Let's do this and do faith. Let's see, I have 189. Some of them have quite a few more. Really, it's only going to be a few of these guys. Salt. If I have six votes for salt, one, two, three, four, five, six, I pretty much outnumber all of them. Let's do that, possibly. I hope this counts. If I lose both, that'll suck. Well, if I lose both, I get my points back, so it doesn't suck as much. Uh, no, Citrus lost? What? Wow, y'all spent all your money on that. Faith, awesome. I, at least I got the faith part. Jeez. You need to attack that guy. You need to keep defending. And you need to attack that guy. And we'll just, we're gonna slowly like push one little team out there to take it. Basically, that's my plan. In the corner of the Indian state in Bihar, there is a magical place that one might think of as the hub of Buddhism. Well, there we go. We built that, which gives us one point towards uh, diplomacy. Yes, we're the only one with that, thank God. Um, I'm going to need you to go there. Actually, I need you to go there. Repair, then build a farm. And promotion, evangel evangelize. That's the word I'm looking for. Let's do an encampment right there. That'll be perfect. And I wanted you to do a holy site as well. Really only holy until you get up here. Hmm. Mountain, woods, woods. I guess we can wait for the holy site then. Let's do... Just do a few men. Let's do... We're going to get horsemen soon because we got horses coming in now. I bought two lots of lands, which helped out with that down here, right there. So I bought this one and that one, and now we can have horses coming in. Thank goodness. Um, this one... Last construction, three faith, two food. Shrines provide equal food. Let's do, let's see here. Envoy of each city-state, it first adopts this religion. Plus one envoy when it first adopts this religion. Yes. And then, oh, they're not adopt, they're not my religion, dang it. Um, Evangelize again. I need you to attack him. Plus five combat strength when the borders of friendly cities, missionaries, and postals are 30% cheaper. Religious spread to Dacian cities 25% stronger, boosted to 50. Let's do this one. Thank you very much. Let's have you move one step closer so that we have to attack him. Thank you. We can get him out. And then let's purchase a missionary just so that I can have both of these city-states definitely under me <laughs> under my religion at least under me under my religion yeah that's what i meant all right so we got our first missionaries out here let's see if we can oh there already are so that was easy let's have you attack this guy real quick 
Almost there. Oh no, he is dead. That's for, that's for sure dead right there. Um, and I have this guy coming. This is the easiest way for me to take care of anything, is have a swordsman in front and have an archer behind him, just so he has backup, pretty much. And he can just continuously heal, as long as my archer can take care of things. And then, um, I have this guy showing up. He's gonna go hang out over here, because this is gonna be an encampment, and I'm gonna keep an archer there as well. And I have one archer in each city, and then I have a few extras that are gonna be built up while I take these guys down to here. Um, I'm not gonna have an archer in our capital just because it'll be in the encampment, so I don't really see a need because I can go back and forth pretty quickly between the two. I am not not giving you my horses. I've worked so hard to get these horses, you are not getting a thing. And it might be time for us to expand while we're in the middle of this and go right over here. Oh, I forgot to check to make sure Buenos Aires did add, I mean Candy did add a, a uh, envoy to us. We will find out. Let's see. Not yet. Huh. I wonder if they will. Or maybe I just read it wrong. There's a possibility I read it wrong. Of course there is that possibility. Uh, you can stay there for now. You need a spread. You need to shoot this guy. There are way too many scouts here. Just take him out. It's okay. It's just a scout. Very good. Very, very good. <laughs> of course she wants to make peace just when she has ran out of troops and I am starting to enclose on her own country. Well, you see, I don't know if you guys have watched my channel for that long, but whenever Whenever someone makes war on me, I don't stop until they're gone. So, no, she can go fuck herself. Because, no, you started this all, you got in bed with this Matthias dude. Both of you want it. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Nope. Goodbye. In fact, if I get enough money, I can levy Buenos Aires as well as Candies, because this is only 880, and Candies right here is 540. And once I levy both of them, oh, it'll be like a <laughs> like a slaughter. It'll honestly just be a straight slaughter. That's just what's gonna happen. And I'm gonna wait until I get to that point, and they're gonna sit here and they're gonna deal with it until we get to that point. But I am out of time for this episode. I'm gonna go over here and quickly make this city. And then that'll, actually I'm gonna end it right now, pretty much on camera, hopefully. But yeah, I, I've been running a little behind just because I'm trying to get ahead because I have a little thing I'm gonna go do next week, which there'll be a, people are starved for, oh, go away. Who cares about you, Russia? You don't know what you're saying half the time anyways. But I'm going to an event next weekend, so I'm trying to get ahead with videos, which is why I'm, there might be a little bit shorter than normal, but hey, I'm trying. Of course, there's a, a lovely drought. That's great. That is just great. Yay, you are Eastern Orthodoxy, and now you got 10 of my envoys there. That's quite nice. Let us rejoice in that. No, I'm kidding. Um, let's do the government plaza, because we're going to really need it as we move forward there because that could be farms that could all be farms this not so much that could be a farm too yeah i'm guessing let's do there and just so i can get that one building that gives me a builder every time i plant a new city that's extremely useful early in the game and i should be building those government cities even earlier but I, I often forget but yeah thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this little war the next one will be our retaliation most likely against england first and then another episode about matthias and then we'll focus on winning by diplomacy <laughs> after i destroy everyone that's the only time you focus on diplomacy is after you've destroyed the entire world <laughs> Thank you guys again. Leave a like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll see you all in the next episode. Bye, guys. No, I told you. No, you are not making peace with me. Go away. Both of you. Go away. I'm trying to end this episode. Jeez.